okay guys i welcome you guys again to another tutorial video so in this video i will show you i will be showing you or i will show you the best ai tool to use to convert your african folktale you know scripts towards to ai voice do you understand that's test to speech good and reason i will be using or i'll be advising you to you know to use this ai is because one you can actually generate a very long script using this particular ai that is one two you will be able to use you know nigerian english accent on this particular ai app that's two and thirdly is what it is very easy and free of charge you all do know very well that if you should use 11 labs like people that is very very familiar with 11 labs 11 labs cannot you know cannot generate at once 1000 words for you i think the least 11 labs can actually go i mean the free version i think the least 11 labs can actually go is that should be there about or 500 or something like that do you understand now let's take good now let's take for instance looking at this place now this is 11 labs so let me go back and show you something this is actually what now as you can see here this ai test to speech the name is 11 labs are you seeing this is 11 labs here now as you can see the maximum words you can actually generate with 11 labs is what it's total of 500 can you see if you go above 500 11 labs will not be able to generate this stuff for you using free version so they will require or ask you to pay for the premium version before you can be able to use this the same thing is applicable to other ai too like i think voice magic or something like that voice magic too does the same thing but before you can be able to generate too much you must pay for pro version do you understand but in this particular ai too you don't need to pay for anything because everything is just there for you and it's very very easy one it is you know self-explanatory to use that's one two it has more features too then three you can generate as many as one thousand one five two thousand three thousand even you can generate five thousand words at once using this particular ai tool and which ai tool am i actually talking about the ai tool i'm talking about is what clip sharp i don't know if many of you have heard about this but on my dm many were like which um ai tool is preferable for converting our african folktale you know stories story scripts to ai voice so once you click on your clip sharp do not forget the link of this particular website. I will make it available in my video description. So do where to check my video description. So once you click here, you click on sign in. You just have to sign in to this clip shop. Now, after you've signed into this clip shop, let me now shock you guys now and, you know, and tell you that you can generate as many as possible. Now, looking at here, as you can see, I've used this clip shop to generate a lot of voices for someone folktale because I'm helping someone to create a particular folktale. Now, then after this, now let me go to my chat GPT. So, this is my chat GPT. As you can see, the total words count. I don't know if this word will be here. Okay, good. So, as you can see, the total words count you are seeing here is 3,133. So, what I'll be doing is this. Let me copy the whole of this. So let me just copy the whole of this word. Can you see I've selected all? Then let me copy. Okay, let me just cut. Now I've, I've copied all the words. To prove it, let me paste it and show you guys that yes, I've copied it. Let me paste. It's coming up, guys. Done. Okay, now so I have pasted now. Can you see that's 3133? So what I have to do is just to go to my clip sharp. okay so let's wait for it to open guys at this point i'm begging you if you are new to my channel kindly hit the subscribe button subscribe like this video drop your comment share this video and 
do not forget to turn on your notification sign so you always get notified whenever what i drop a new tutorial video now so this is it what i need to do is this let me just click here and go to home let me start afresh do you understand now so once you are done logging into your shop and uh, clip shop this is how it will look like then you click on this text to speech here So once you click on test to speech, it brings you to this part. You click on what? You select the same test to speech here. Now this is the main interface of you know clip sharp that we will be working with. Good. So after you have this now, next you need to do is come to this part. Oh my goodness, what's happening? Okay, now so this is what we have. So come to this part that says what what you they like to see so come here and paste that word that we copied from chat gpt so that's what i'm doing now as you can see maximum character is what 7650 can you see do not forget that 11 loves the maximum you can you know you can convert is 500 do you understand so this is what you need to do just come here now you start deleting you just need to delete until it gets to that exact number do you understand so let's just keep on deleting until it matches the requirement do you understand so let's delete delete and see the maximum you know word count we can actually convert at once here in what here in clip shop so that's what i'm doing guys now, so looking here now, I have pasted the story script, which is what you are seeing here. Follow my arrow sign. Then after that, now, next thing we need to do is to save it. Do you understand? So for us to save it, this is what we need to do. For us to save it, there is two buttons here. So you click on the save button. Then after the saving, after it has saved, next thing we need to do is to preview it like to see how it sounds so once you click on save then come to this part here you select the accent you want as you can see the default setting is what um american english can you see english into back a united kingdom what that simply means is if you should be using that the accent at which this ai you know, we read your story will be American English. And do not forget that this story is just for African. The name is African Folktale. So you got to use Nigeria, can you see? So for you to use Nigeria, you have to select English, then into bracket Nigeria. So this is the perfect option we need to use. Do you see that? Good. So once you click on it, it has been selected. Then this Ezine represents female voice. Why the second one represents male voice? So I'll be using Ezine, that's the female voice. Then after that, now, this part that says what? So after you've selected Ezine, then this part, now, you have to click on this part that says what? Advanced. So once you click on Advanced, then you click on that default. Then here is how you want the pronunciation of words to be. Do you understand? If you want it to be more of emotic, you have to make it very high. But let me select high. Then this part that says pass is the, you know, the reading speed. It's how you want the speed in to be. But for me, I don't want it to be normal standard. I will have to, like, take it back a little. Do you understand? Then after that, now, next you need to do is just to click this save button here to save the settings. Do you get? So after you've saved the, saved the settings now, you are good to go. And after saving, we have to preview to see how the stuff is like. Do you understand? And after that, we export. And that is just how you can actually do what? Create a perfect story, you know, a perfect AI voiceover for your African folktale story on YouTube. Now, it has been saved. So what we need to do, let's just play and see how this stuff sounds. His savings grow. It turns it slowly. Yeah. Shut up. So I have to delete this one. 
why do I delete to okay then let's play in southeastern Nigeria struggles under the weight of poverty his father has long passed leaving his mother and younger siblings to survive on the meager income from their small farm despite his hard work the harvest is barely enough to feed his family each passing day is a constant reminder of their so can you see so this is just the easiest way you can actually do what come up with a perfect test to speech for your what african folktale script thank you for watching and please next thing you need to do is just to click on this export button to export it and you are good to go guys so that's just how you can do that thanks and please do not forget to like share subscribe drop your comments and please turn on your notification sign bye